All right, so we finally made it. It's 5.22 in the afternoon. And we're stopped here to get our staging, air down some, and uh, get started on the beginning of the trail. And Harold is airing down the trailer a little bit. Harold, what'd you say you were going to air it down to? Okay. Alright, here we go. We're at the beginning of the rim rocker. Woohoo! Which is actually part of the main road right now, but uh, no change. Getting in the net uncom uncom <laughs> yep. uh, National Forest, so. And for those of uh, those of you new to our channel, uh, at this point, we're not one of those documentary channels. All our videos are mainly about our trips and our excursions with our friends. Uh, we try to be creative on some of the stuff, but some of it we're still real new at. And, uh, just trying to capture it on video. Have a little fun with it. So if you like what you're seeing, just make sure and subscribe to the channel and ring the bell so you get notifications. I hope you enjoyed just the scenery and the camaraderie we have at camp. And if you have any suggestions on what you want to see while we're doing this, just feel free to leave it in the comments. So sit back, grab you some popcorn and a cold beverage, and enjoy. And as always, thank you for watching. Railhead there or something. Yeah. Oh no, that's just Red Canyon Trail. Alright, here we are. We're seeing a little bit of snow on the sides of the road. We're at uh, 9,789 feet elevation. Uh, we should get up around 10,000 through this section up here somewhere. Look at all that snow down there. Yeah, well, it's all off in the trees, and the sun can't really get to it to melt it off. It looks like some big shell. Yeah, if I put mud flaps on here, it wouldn't be so bad. Whew.
video with your camera outside? Or? Yep. Y'all ready now? Where are we're, we're just up around the bend. We're out taking a picture. We're up just around the corner. We're taking a picture. Yeah, I just wanted if y'all seen that scenic route, that scenic overlooking we're pulling through right now. We saw it, but by the time I saw it, I didn't stop. I heard about it. All right, so we're pulling in. We're in there now. Let's go take a look right quick. All right, friends. We finally made it to our first stop for the Rim Rocker Trail and our last stop for day two. Uh, we're camping at the uh, Iron Springs campground. It's dispersed camping. There's no electricity, no lights, no nothing. They do have a vault toilet. I'm not sure what it looks like, whether we'll use it or not, but uh, yeah, we do have that. This is the entrance to the campground. We had to pile over a little bit of snow there. And come on in over here. I'll show you the campground and our stuff, and then we're gonna get some dinner going. Uh, just something quick and simple tonight. And then uh, we'll be back on the trail in the morning. So there's our site right there. I've got a campfire started. Right there, it's uh, starting up. And there's the uh, truck and the camper. My setup, and there's Mike and Teresa setup, and then this is just a big loop. There's the vault toilet that goes around, and comes right back to where we're at. So, like I said, we're gonna go fix something to eat real quick. I won't film that, and uh, yeah, spend the night here, and then move on find another spot for tomorrow night. Well good morning friends. It's our first morning to wake up on the trail this morning. Uh, it's about 58 degrees, not too bad. The sun's coming up back over behind me over there. I don't know if you can hear that or not, but we got coffee on and it's just about made. So let's go over and check it out. There's the camper. And nope, it's not made, just the water ready. Alright. Well, let me get this coffee on and uh, we'll get this morning going so we can get back on the trail. Alright, so we filled our bellies up. Getting ready to pull out this fine little campsite here. I wanted to, want to show you something. See all these nice big old pine trees? Pine trees all over the place. And that one lone aspen right there in the middle of all this mess. Yep. That's some barking spiders, I think. Oh, so, yeah, we had an outhouse if we needed it. Uh, like I said in an earlier video, I think it's a vault toilet. Um, but uh, here we are. All packing up, just about ready to roll out of here. And uh, we'll head out, get back on the rim rocker and uh, see what else we can find. Uh, let's see here. Right there is our path out of here. So we'll get in here and get these things fired up get going. Yep, you got the sticker for the trail now.
we're letting Miss Katrina do a little driving for this leg of the trip. Let me do a little sightseeing for James. <laughs> yes. Uh, we stopped here with this dirty truck to this little overlook spot to let y'all get a view of what we're seeing besides that muddy trailer. This is just the beginning. Time to move onward. We stopped on the rim rocker, take a few pictures, and this is what I got. Oh, she's so dirty. Oh, lots of cleaning. A whole lot of cleaning. Well, have a little detour. We got to Nucla and they were out of fuel. Actually, they weren't out of fuel. They were having their pin pads worked on on the fuel tanks and we were not on the fuel pumps and we were not allowed to pump fuel. So we got ahead a little more south to Neutrina and top our tanks off there. And then we'll come back and try to finish up the rim rocker. Fun times. Fun, fun. So we've left Nucla. Actually, I had to run down and get gas down in Nutria, Nutrita. There's Nucla gas pumps are being worked on. So we're now on the second part of the uh, Rim Rocker Trail past Nucla. It's supposed to be more interesting than the first half that we were on, so we will see. Back on. See what we see. So now we're getting off the long maintained gravel roads and turning on to what's going to prove to be, may prove to be, more technical sections of the road. As you can see the sign right there, Rim Rock Trail to the left. And here's where we're going down. Decided to pull over right here and have some lunch. So. Everybody's scrambling around, making some sandwiches. <sighs> Get a little fuel in us, and we will get on down the trail. Um, after we left camp this morning, the yeah, roads were a little bit wet and mucky and muddy. As you can see, 
right there on the side of the truck. But look at my camper. There's supposed to be a propane tank right there underneath all that mud. All the way up on the awning. Down on the tires. All the way around. Back still clean though. So we'll get over and eat my lunch. Say hi to my honey. And we'll uh, get back on the trip. Come ride with us. So this road leads down to a water crossing right down through here, which is still part of the Rim Rocker Trail. Uh, we've had reports that the water is really high, really fast, and a lot of rocks have washed through there. So I don't recommend us going. I uh, just had two side-by-side -side vehicles come out, kind of gave the same report to us, but we're going to walk down there and check it out anyway, to, just to see by, hand, by ourselves. And if we can't go that way, then we'll turn back around. We'll go back down that road, which is called Ballpark Cutoff. It'll take us back to the highway. We're down the highway, and then we'll take another cutoff to come back and pick the trail up again on the other side of this ravine here. So, we're going to take a walk down here and look at it. All right, we were just told by some guys on side-by-sides that the water crossing, we might be able to make it, but the ravine was washed out. So we're gonna walk down, and check it out. More to come. All right, so here we are. We made it. If you look down there, there's a pretty big boulder in the way. Uh, those guys on the side of the side didn't even go through that. They went up around that way and went up. And it's supposed to be larger ravines up the road, so I think we're going to go ahead and bypass this and pick it up on the other side. See you on the other side. Here we are at the end of Lake 2, which runs from Nuka all the way up to Highway 141. Now we're going to jump on Highway 141 and run down the highway a little bit and pick up the last leg. Hey, we're coming. Just took us a little while to get down that hill. We had to pick up the last leg of the Rim Rocker Trail. I guess we made a good choice. This is where the trail would have come out road closed. I got you. Okay, well, you're already too far. I was going to try to find the drone and catch it behind the corner around that corner, but that's alright. Yeah, apparently all of my flying got nothing. Come on around. So he has room to pull in behind us. That's good.
we did not sleep here. But this little jaunt off the main road. Uh, the fire pit right there. And we can camp right here. And look at the views out there. Mountains. Little plateaus. Huge canyon down there. Valleys. See down here. Take a peek. See how close we can get. Man, oh man. Sorry for the wind. This is on my camp, my phone. I see lots of those that come a week. And that's where we would have camped, right up the hill there. All right, back on the roof. Beautiful scenery off the side of this bluff we're on up here. River and the highway down below. And then right down there is an old mine. I believe they call that Joe Mine. Back on down the river. Get my gear in the mirror. So let's go up and check it out. I'm down here on the road where we came in. We got in here last night. <sighs> Pretty tired. Picked us some dinner and we just went straight to bed. But this is uh, how we were set up. Back up in here. Let's come around over here, the other side of the trailers. Walk right up here. We can set our chairs up here and have a spectacular view. That's how far away we were from this walk, just right up the hill. So, we we'll get everybody else up and uh, get us some coffee going, some breakfast, and we'll be back on the trail. For the last part of the trail today, and we'll end up in U uh, Moab, Utah. Come on along.
good morning. It's uh, Saturday morning, I believe, on the trail. And uh, I just woke up, waiting for everybody else to get up, some coffee going. Yeah, maybe get some uh, breakfast. I just wanted to show y'all our campsite for the night and our view. Let me uh, turn this thing around. Breakfast taco. <laughs> In the mountains. All right, folks, we're back on the trail again. Should be our last day on the trail before we get to Moab. So uh, follow along. And as always, thanks for watching and stay in tune. Hope we bring you good content to watch. Hey, family. Hey, friends. Let's go. It's breathtaking. My breath away. Hey. Hey. <laughs> they say just give it a turn or two and the scenery and the topography changes. <laughs> it's a little steep. I know it's not going to show up on the camera, but it is a little steep. If you like our content, hit the like button, subscribe, and then click that bell to get notifications of new videos.